Wait, what is this? I didn't even listen to this yet. I just saw it, so I liked it. I have no idea. Is this like I a have clip? more or less, but like, yeah, I mean, his community is the reason that I no longer wanted to do the show. It was, uh... Dude, he's just, every day, just Hassan's community is anti-Semitic. Hassan's community is anti-Semitic. It's so shitty. So bad Not faith. all of it, but like... He a doesn't actually believe that. Large, uh, like Ben said, though, it's just all optics with this guy. All optics. A contingency of it was really... What up, Pavuki? Uh, Welcome in. In my opinion, not, not something I wanted to be involved in. The dialogue that they were having about us was pretty wild it was in my opinion not something i wanted to be involved in and not something i certainly wanted to have on my channel and pr and promote and have yeah. people going entering a community that uh says such things about me you know what i mean like like i have more or less but like yeah i mean his it walks like a zionist if it talks like a zionist is probably a zionist but like hassan says this guy he's like he's like 90 percent there has always been 90 percent there and the more the more he is met with like people not treating him nice, it is going to push him further and further to the opposite side. But that like he's a fucking adult. Okay? He should know. He should know better than to just like let like a bunch of like random faces like no like literally like no faces on the internet just like people who are anonymous get to him like that. You see, yeah, he's fucking 40. His community is the reason that I, but know. I do agree, like what Michael Brooks said, and that's why Hassan treats him the way he does. No, despite him, like every day, being like Hassan fosters an anti-Semitic community. Hassan's still like, no, guys, like chill out. Like I said yesterday, Hassan would have scolded me had he seen my post. He probably did. He probably did see it. Ethan probably saw it. There's, I'm getting likes every second. Okay, it's like how many views it has is crazy. But Hassan would scold me for that. He would say, like, no, stop this, you guys. You're just, like, egging it on. But I do feel like what I said is, like, the truest, the truest take on the situation. It's exactly what Ethan wants. No longer Which wanted is to why every day he's, like, he's fostering an a anti-Semitic community. Do the show. It was, uh... But Hassan said, I watched a little bit. Did what you said, Chad, I watched a little bit after stream, him watching the video and, and talking about it, and then him just, like, ending stream because he was just, like, upset. Hassan will, like, the way he goes about it is just so perfect. Because then when Ethan wants to pull it up the next day on stream, like, oh, Hassan was talking about me. It's just Hassan talking about the issues and being like, when we start talking about all this stuff about Ethan not caring about things and hyper-focusing on Ethan, we stop caring about the actual issue of Palestine, you know? And, like, people being murdered there every fucking day. And it's so true. It's so true. Which is why I made my follow-up tweet. Like, I don't want to be known as the person. Like, it would be sick if... If 8,000 likes on Twitter turned into 8,000 views, but I also don't want to be known as the guy that, that like, talked about Ethan. He's not somebody that's ever I've ever cared about other than the Steven Crowder thing and then when he started doing leftovers. Before that, he was always the guy that just liked to say slurs on YouTube. He was the edgy guy that I did, didn't care for. But I don't want to be known as the guy that, that's, like, sitting there talking about Ethan. Not all of it, but like a large uh, contingency of it was really yeah, so gracefully, and like, I think it's because, like I said, Hassan cares about the issues, um, and he cares about friendship. He felt he had a genuine friendship with Ethan, whereas I think Ethan just viewed it as transactional. Um, and Ethan is now willing to just like throw it all under the bus in hopes that Hassan will get baited and then start fighting back with him so then he can turn his whole show for like a month into anti-Hassan shit. He's going to have Destiny sitting right next to him and they're going to be talking about it. Uh, the in my opinion, the not, not something I wanted to be involved in. The dialogue that they were having about us. There's, I just can't listen to somebody that was ever part of the fucking IDF, dude. I can't. Oh my God. Am I a friend of the show? 